Hello everybody, welcome back. It's Judicious Fire, and I am here with the new Line of Defense game mode. Uh, just uh, got acquired the new heroes today, uh, both of them. I'm going to be using one of them in this game mode, and uh, hopefully uh, we'll be successful. Please hit the uh, subscribe button, notification bell, you'll know when these videos come out. We are on the race to 10,000 subs. We are nearly there. Help us out. Let's move over that milestone of 10K. I assembled a team of 10. I've never played this before. Uh, it is a tower style defense uh, game. Uh, I actually was introduced to Castle Clash by my love of tower defense games. I was uh, playing tower defense in 2015 maybe and saw an ad for Castle Clash, thought it was also a similar tower defense game, gave it a try, found out it was actually a base defense game where you uh, upgraded heroes. Now we upgrade heroes and we watch our base be destroyed by a simple pet. So let's move into line of defense. Uh, let's try stage one. So what we can win, we can win for the golden seals that allow us to upgrade our heroes based on our might level and four soul stones for one of the new heroes. Uh, this is the team of 10 that I have assembled. I've done so for a variety of reasons. One, I want to try the new really good hero. Uh, he freezes stuff all around and does a fantastic job. I'll put a video out on him today. I'm using PD because in any game mode I want to have a PD. I'm also using Cause for the f the freeze paral the paralysis bubble, Dove because she's awesome, Zef because he's awesome, Gunny because she has the highest DPS, Walla not necessarily for the heals but for the slow. Uh, we have to stop heroes from entering our side of the territory that requires slow. Same thing with Laz. I want to freeze people up. Bloody Mary in case I run into any damage capped heroes I need to take out and Lava because he paralyzes as well. I have set all of them to a defensive uh, setup, uh, Sacred Light, Flame Guard, Wicked Armor, stuff like that in order to keep them alive. Uh, I've given them all attack pets. And in addition, I've given every single one of them an Empower. And even though several, several of them are not auto proc, they have Empower so when the bad guy finally approaches them, they will be on full energy and will be able to attack immediately. Uh, what am I able to do here? What do I do? What's happening? Did it start? I didn't mean for it to start. I guess the moment you put your, your guys on the board, it, it, it just goes. What's happening? I haven't put all my heroes on. I'm only allowed to use six out of the 10 heroes. Well, I wouldn't have used these six. Okay, well, we'll see how it goes. Doesn't look like any of the bad guys can get past the, the entryway. That's great. Uh, you can also see the amazing freeze. It's that freezing rain that's coming down from the new hero. Ooh. Uh, now we'll move on to this next stage. What can we win? More of the same. Okay. So you only have 30 seconds to put your guys on the board. In tower defense games, you want to place heroes where they are uh, definitely able to do the most amount of attacking. So let's try this. Oh my gosh, what? It's, uh, I can't get the timing right. It's like the second you, you place your heroes is done. Well, we'll see how it goes. I would not have placed any of my heroes here. It, it, you see where uh, the, the road 
creates like a U-turn, that's where you want to place heroes. Uh, you want them to go, you want the bad guys to have the longest amount of time under attack from your heroes. So placing them on the long road, not going to be good. They're in the corners where the heroes have to loop all the way around. Okay, we got that. Okay, last level. Let's try to do this correctly. Okay, they're all going to come from the... They'll all eventually pass the right side. So forget stacking bad guys on the first entryway. Let's get uh, PD right there. Let's get Kaz right there. Dove, they start coming already. I think that there is a great benefit to having Pumpkin Duke with Empower right at the center. Because look at what's happening. Nobody can even, nobody even gets near the heroes. They all die right away. Are you kidding me? What? I'm actually frozen in this position. Are you joking? What can I keep doing? Did I win? Did I beat everything? It was a joke. I could have done that with one hero. I could have stuck my stinking paladin out there in one. Do you just keep fighting the same level again and again? You do. Oh, that's weak. Let's put PD. Let's freeze him up with that. Freeze him up with that. Freeze him up with that. Get Dove in there. Zeph in there. This is ridiculous. Well, so anyway, the objective of the game mode is you see where the two entry points are. You see in the lower right-hand corner, there's a red space. That red space is our home base. If one of the bad guys touches that red sp uh, space, we lose a life. We have 10 lives at the beginning of this game mode. And as we can see, nothing's happening. Even the main boss dies right away. Lordy. But I don't get any more rewards. Is that it? Just one second. Line of defense is 12 days. You can enter the stage as many times as you want, but you can only claim the reward once. Well, we won, everybody. Okay. Uh, I guess that's it. Hmm. We'll run one more just for fun. Let's just do Pumpkin Duke. And let's also do... Zeph. And as our final line of defense, we'll do Dove. Do you see that Pumpkin Duke is killing everybody just by himself? And what the little that are out there are being taken care of by the Love Doves. Oh my gosh. And now this so-called juggernaut, they should call him jugger, jugger nothing. He did not, he's not doing anything. I don't want him getting past. Got him. All right. Well, we got everything we could possibly get. That's sad. Boy, they don't give you much. A um, couple of soul stones and some crappy, like 15 uh, little merit things. Uh, that's terrible. 
Well, anyway, uh, hopefully they're going to be doing something, or hopefully I'm missing some kind of advanced stage on this. I don't know. But I believe I got through it, and I don't think there's anything else to do. No, that, that's it. One, two, and three. Mm -mm -mm. Let's take a look at our rewards. Okay, defense chest one. Mm-hmm. Rare defense chest. Mythic defense chest. Well, in conclusion, it seems to be a fairly simple game mode. Uh, classic tower defense rules apply. Try to maximize the amount of time that the bad guys are around your heroes by placing them in the area of the path that causes the most amount of um, interaction with your bad, with your uh, good guys. So uh, and I would use a Pumpkin Duke. I think that kind of a buffer. You saw what he did. He was a one-man army. Except for the Juggernaut, he pretty much killed everybody just by himself. Uh, happy clashing. Enjoy the new update. I will catch you on multiple videos over the next uh, day or two as I show you the new heroes, the new pets, etc., etc. Enjoy the holidays and enjoy the game. See ya.